Hey, look at this guy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's a baby over there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's right there. I got an itch. Wish I could get it. We're cruising down an old country road right now. Great place to live if you owned a dirt bike. Some cows. Yeah, beautiful land. A country dog over here. He was in the middle of the road. He said, I don't recognize that. I don't recognize that guy. He's back in the middle of the road. So he's back there. He says, I watch out for everybody. Tell you, you would not want your brakes to fail now. <laughs> Here's a kayaking or um, rafting spot. I think. I think on the way back, I'm gonna check that out. See what that's like. Here's this little bridge. I think I would have been doing burnouts as a kid here. Here's the gorge. The river's not ripping today. There's more parking over here. We might be crossing right here later too. I think that, that's a trail we might might be crossing. It's kind of in the middle of nowhere. Just heard a strange sound. It was either a big bear grunting or a uh, or an elk. It sounded big. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it's about uh, quarter to eight in the morning. Going down this pretty easy trail. <clears throat> Be a great trail for a dirt bike. Going to an overlook right now. Hoping a bear doesn't interrupt us. Just heard that sound again. I think it's cows. It's coming from over there. Probably those cows that we passed on the way in here. And there's a bunch of crows squawking over there. Somebody's shooting over there. That's nice. It's like, I don't know, 7.45 in the morning. Always nice to go out for a little target, <laughs> target practice. Pretty funny. Here. Sound like a shotgun. Okay, we came in on that bridge right down there. If you can see it. There's a oak or a granite bluff. Actually, it's probably limestone. Yeah, it's limestone. And unfortunately, the sun's in our eyes. But there's the river. The river goes through that gorge right there. Another overlook over there. Try that. Pretty nice though. We'll try another panoramic view. Try to stay below the sun. There's some cliffs in the distance over there. I'm guessing the Indians probably hung out there if there's caves. There's some caves under here too. You can take a trail underneath this sandstone cliff. And uh, it's 
a couple caves under there too. Pretty nice. And then they have this boardwalk here. So you don't have to destroy everything coming in here. Pretty nice. It's got this uh, kind of moss everywhere. And pines. Nice looking little pine trees. It's a nice spot, nice and calming. You can hear that river down there. Looks like a uh, waterfall way down at the end there. I think that's where the sound's coming from. I believe the river's flowing away from us towards the gorge over there. Well, it looks pretty low right now. I don't think there's going to be too many people uh, heading down there in a kayak today. Unless they just paddle around in this area here, which would still be fun. It's crystal clear water. Nice area. Can you hear these animals? Yeah, roosters and cows. I heard an owl over here. There's more of those holly trees right there. This is not a cow. Jesus, it sounded like a nuke alert. <laughs> Thing was freaking out. More of that moss. Squirreler. Him. It's moving. I got stuff to do. A couple of mounds over there. Beyond that stump. A couple of mounds here that just don't look natural at all. Almost like it's an old stone foundation or something. A root cellar. I, if it was winter time, I'd go over there and check it out, but... Um, be afraid of stepping on a frickin' copperhead. So, I don't think I'll be doing that today. But I'll make a mental note of where it is. Listen, can you hear that animal? Hear it whistling? I don't know if that's some kind of bird. It stopped. There it goes. Strange.